I went up to the University of Alberta as a jock to play football uh, for the Alberta Golden Bears. And uh, I went in one night to the university cafeteria and this beautiful young lady walks in and I said, uh, now, who's that? And Doug said, that's Gene Rogers. The Alberta University Music Association asked me to give a concert, and I did. So I did two or three times, but Peter was courting me, and so he came to his first concert. <laughs> I didn't have much of a choice. You got the right question there. No, I'm here. And here I am falling in love with this gal whose whole life has been the arts. <laughs> well, I went to football games and he came to concerts. <laughs> I ran for student union president and she gave a pitch for me which involved uh, talking about uh, how interested uh, Peter Lougheed was in, in the arts. So it was all part of a <laughs> political auction campaign. We fell in love immediately and four years later we were married. But when Piers elected as Premier, we went to Jasper for a little break and rest. She uh, thought at the time that uh, Alberta needed to develop a Department of Culture. And we were walking in Jasper. Peter was saying, now for my cabinet, I'm going to have this person as head of that department. And he went through all these departments. And I said, Peter, I didn't hear culture. You have to have culture. <laughs> It was because Jean took a leadership role, and she came in and spoke to the caucus, and she just swayed them, and she overwhelmed them. He established a Department of Culture, and I think there was only one other province in Canada at that point that had a Department of Culture. It was, it was the best thing. It was good for Alberta. It's quite amazing, isn't it? I'm very proud. We were a team, you know, and she was supportive of me in many of the other areas, but I was very supportive of her in the cultural side, and uh, she was strong about it and uh, com really committed to the idea that we should have a Department of Culture in Alberta. 